They call it a smart pacifier, and it is. Although other than some lightweight electronics, it's not any different than the ones babies put in their mouths all the time. Basically, the, every, every baby uh, enjoy the playing with this pacifier. Chung Kun Kim is an associate professor of mechanical engineering at Washington State University, Vancouver, and on the project. The smart pacifier we've developed can automatically collect the saliva sample from baby and continuously monitor their ion level in real time. He explains that the smart pacifier monitors sodium and potassium ion levels of babies with health problems like dehydration due to premature birth. It would be used in hospital NICU units, replacing invasive blood draws from babies. Unlike blood draws, most babies are actually soothed by pacifiers, and information collected in saliva can be transmitted by a wireless connection to medical professionals. We believe our device has an ability to provide the real-time health information for immediate feedback and treatment. Professor Kim and a handful of colleagues and students at WSUV have been working on this high-tech pacifier for a year and a half, teamed up with other universities in the U.S. and South Korea. Clinical trials are still to come, but they hope the small medical device eventually replaces blood draws and a lot of wires and electrodes on NICU babies. And then it could be developed for use at home, so parents can do a variety of different health checks of their babies. Well, our next plan is we want to make these pacifiers more recyclable and affordable, so anybody can get it from the shelf of the, the market. Tim Gordon, KGW News.